Hey, what's up guys? It's Risky here. Welcome to another Call of the Wild video. Now, I do want to mention before we get this video started, if I sound like extra, like my voice sounds extra deep today, it's because I literally just got out of bed like five minutes ago. So, um, Call of the Wild is life, man. I just got out of bed and hopped on this game because the Bloodhound DLC has been released. This is very exciting. Very exciting. We're finally going to be able to get out here and do some hunting with the dogs. Obviously, I didn't get it early because I'm not a community content creator. I am a reject of the community and I am proud of it. But anyways, we're going to go here to our cache, our outpost, and we're going to buy ourselves our first dog. So my dogs, we have, we have none purchasable dogs. We have a bloodhound. He costs zero dollars for our first one. And let's see what coat we're going to go for. So I love black and tans. I have a black and tan dog in real life. We're going to go for a male. Name your dog. What should we name him? You know, I'm going to name him Hank because in real life, I used to have a tracking dog. He was a blue tick beagle mix and he was a tracking machine. The amount of deer we tracked with that guy in real life uh, was, was insane. That was, that was a damn good dog. He unfortunately died a couple years ago, but we're going to name our first dog on Call of the Wild. Hank. <laughs> I see the little icon down at the bottom. Oh, there he is. There's Hank. Hank. <laughs> Let's go, buddy. Wow. Our first doggo in Call of the Wild. B to interact. Okay, you know what? Maybe I should make my whistle button something different. Hold on. B. All right. Now, now we won't whistle every time. Let me do it. Um, play. Let's play with Hank. Okay, the animation. Uh, that one didn't go through, I guess. I guess he has to be standing completely still. Boom. Shake. Good boy. That's so cool. The animations are fantastic. They did a really, really good job. Let's figure out something for Hank to track. Let's, is there a command we need to give him? Uh, stay, play, pet. I don't think so. I think he kind of automatically does his thing once we start running out here. So we're just gonna like run off in the distance somewhere and maybe Mr. Hank here will pick up some tracks. I just wanna see what he's all about. Maybe track one or two animals with him today and that's gonna be it. I also plan on making a patch notes videos right after this one. So the video after this should be a patch notes video going over all the important information that came with this update. And the good news is this update is out on all platforms. Do you want to track this for me? Maybe I need to pick it up first. Examine track. Will Hank go for that? What does he do? That's what we want to do. Now he's working. Now he's doing that thing. He's using that nose. Track not found. Okay. Oh, he only searches for blood. He doesn't follow tracks. I think. Right? No, he does. He does. I don't know what you're doing, buddy. All right. Well, let's go shoot an animal. All right. There's an animal. We're going to shoot it because I'm most likely not going to drop him. <clears throat> so let's just shoot this guy like right there. I can tell the fonts and stuff for the little icon there that just popped up. It looked a little bit different. I swear that font and stuff was different. Um, and I'm sure that might be something in the patch notes. Like I said, I'm going to be doing a video about that very soon. Like, look, look at the number. Well, I guess you can't see it now, but I'm sure you've seen what I was talking about. The, my question is now, like, why, why would I need my dog to track this thing? You know what I'm saying? That's why a lot of people have been really iffy about these bloodhounds. It's like, why would we need a bloodhound to track this thing? Because it's already super easy. Um, let's see. Let's see what he'll do here. Oh, okay. We level up the tracker. So he's tracking blood right now. So he's on this. He's, he's following our, our bison. Tracking blood, tracking blood. He's going to take us right to it. I guess he'll save you the work, you know. Instead of you having to track yourself, boom, he's standing there. He's like, hey, man, I found it, dude. Look at me. Good boy. Now, let's give you a pet here. Uh, praise? We're going to praise you. Wait, what do we do? I'm hitting I'm hitting all the bu wrong buttons here. Sorry. Pet. There we go. Let's pet you, buddy. I guess we can go here and we can check our hunting dog's status and traits here. So, boom, we can't unlock those yet. We're only level one in companion and level two in tracker. So he's focused and loving, right? Okay, cool. Now we can track this guy, or not track him, but claim him, and boom. Mr. Hank did the job for us. He tracked him. All right, I'm gonna go like wound the absolute hell out of man an animal, like shoot it right in its kneecaps or something. Gosh, that sounds terrible, doesn't it? Let's, uh, let's wound you then. That's a good idea. He's running straight into us. Don't get hit, uh, Mr. Hank. Hopefully that shot him in like the leg. That's kind of what I was going for there. Oh, no, I'm pretty sure I single lunged him. But that's okay. That'll that'll take him a while to die as well, especially with the uh, little 30 out 6 here. So he'll go up in there. He'll probably die up on the hill. And we're going to let Hank do the job. Let's uh, track. Come on, Hank. 
let's track searching for blood it's leveled up the companion now so that's what you do man shoot an animal and then hold down your command button i have no idea what it's going to be on console probably one of the d-pads or something and hit track and he will begin to uh, track that animal that you just shot you know it might take him a second to find the blood but i'm assuming as we level up here as we level up our dog it will get easier and easier for him to find the blood so it'll make this process process much faster it's a very very cool system in the game i don't think i'm gonna be using the bloodhound a crazy amount for this because it's just i don't know it's just that extra thing that you have to wait on you know you have to wait for the dog it's a really really cool system and it seems like they did a very good job on it so far but i feel like in the future once we actually get like uh, dogs that will be able to retrieve ducks and stuff for us if they get rid of the whole like floating duck system and shit and we actually need retrievers i feel like those will be very useful but a bloodhound in a game like this it's kind of iffy but you can see hank is still following he's basically just following this pink line here which is the active track of this moose that we just shot and i can see him there uh, mr hank he's just going up here and watch he's probably gonna start barking here in just a second for us there he goes you found him <laughs> man that sounds you know the crazy thing is that actually sounds pretty close to my dog named hank too like the way the, the little uh the bark there pretty similar all right confirm this guy we did hit we did double lung him i was not honestly surprising out uh, surprising that i was not surprising that i was not expecting that Jeez, if i can speak english sorry sorry i i just woke up like 25 minutes ago now i was trying to hit him here that way he would like really run away but hey we got to see how mr hank works so i'm very excited to see what kind of adventures we'll get into here with mr hank i didn't really want to get into him too much today we'll head over to another map and we'll actually get some kind of hunt you know established and some kind of plan and we'll go out there and let mr hank you know do his thing pet there we go Thanks, buddy. I appreciate you finding the moose for me. You did a good job. Welcome to Call of the Wild, buddy. All right, let's check our levels. We're level two with everything. It seems like the level is going up decently fast. It says our bond is best friend. His focus is alert. Um, I haven't really figured out how this stuff works yet, but hey, we, we've been playing for 25 minutes, so it makes sense. So we haven't unlocked any of these, but in the next video, trust me, we're going to be unlocking ranks. We're going to be doing that stuff. I just want to check them out. So thank you so much for watching. Let me know your experiences with the dogs so far. Let me know what you named your old doggo let me know what you're thinking about it and all that good stuff and i'll see you guys in the next episode stay tuned for the patch notes and improvements video coming very soon see you guys in the next one later